A pet rescue team now back home after a long trip, and they came back with a van full of dogs in need of severe help. And they moved the pets from a failing shelter in Steelville here to the metro. New tonight, our Garrett Hake was there when the rescued pets arrived at their now new temporary home. For the forgotten dogs of Steelville, Missouri, Wayside Waifs will be home for the holidays. Ten dogs, okay, guys. some healthier than others. This one's really got a lot of fleas. Rescued from squalid conditions. It was a metal building that uh, didn't have any windows in it, so the animals didn't have any daylight. Your sister's in here. Come on. Sisters Daisy and Baby Girl had each spent more than a year in kennels there. There's your sister. This is a distemper parvo vaccine that. Uh, own dogs usually get yearly. Good girl. Tonight they took their medicine with a big dose of affection. Good girl. Sarah Little has been rescuing pets from shelters that can no longer care for them and helping out after natural disasters for more than four years. Come on, Daisy. Let's go. Her goals for the pets she saves are modest. Hopefully, you know, these guys get a good home and, and can enjoy the things that that most dogs get to enjoy. Good boy. He's like, where am I? Oh. She says she's got a soft spot for the big black labs like Bull. Oh, Sometimes harder to adopt down than the puppies. He's a great dog. He's going to be a great dog for somebody. Tonight, all 10 dogs will sleep somewhere safe and warm. Tomorrow, they will see a vet. New home for the new year. Unfortunately, these puppies won't be in their new homes by Christmas, but the shelter hopes to get them adopted out by early in the new year. At Wayside Waves, Garrett Hake, 41 Action News. And before leaving today, most of those dogs lived in the Steelville shelter for at least a year.